Leveling up in Halo Infinite is a fairly slow process, and while I'm personally not the biggest fan of it, I made this video to briefly explain how you can maximize your XP gained per time spent playing in the long run. First, what to do, and then an explanation. What you want to do is simple, log on each day and use one double XP booster, if you have one, before playing and completing 6 matches as quickly as possible, preferably within that 1 hour time frame of the XP boost, while also completing as many weekly challenges as you can on the side. If you've completed 6 matches and you still have some of your XP boost left, you can keep playing until that runs out, otherwise you can stop playing for that day and then just come back and repeat the process the next day. So now an explanation, and the main reason why this is the best method is the fairly recent change to XP gains for the first 6 matches played in a day. Unishek put out a tweet explaining this new system. The first match you complete in a day will earn you 300 XP, the second and third will net you another 200 XP each, and matches 4 through 6 will each grant another 100 XP. This adds up to a total of 1000 XP for the first 6 matches played in a day, which is enough to earn 1 level in the battle pass. Considering how easy it is to get this XP compared to XP from weekly challenges, your main goal should be to play at least 6 matches each day. If you have a double XP boost to add on top of this, you will bump your 1000 XP to 2000 XP just for playing 6 matches. That is assuming that you can complete a match every 10 minutes on average, which isn't unreasonable if you are playing arena or quick play, but might be more difficult to accomplish in big team battle. And then of course while you play those matches, you can also try to complete weekly challenges as a bonus. And again, that's your major source of XP, so once you've completed those 6 matches and if you're tired of playing for the day, feel free to stop. Those remaining weekly challenges will still be there the next day to work on with the next 6 daily matches that will give you boosted XP. Assuming you get the 6 daily matches with double XP, along with 500 XP, double to 1000 XP from weekly challenges, that averages to 3 levels per day for around an hour of play. The only time I would say it's worth grinding the weekly challenges is if it is 1 to 2 days before the weekly challenge is reset and you still have a fair amount to complete. At that point, if you really want the weekly capstone challenge reward, it may be worth grinding out those final weekly challenges. Now if you enjoy playing more than an hour of Halo Infinite each day, don't let this video stop you, that's totally fine. This was just meant to help those that don't have as much time to still level up and progress at a reasonable pace. The key is not to grind for hours in a single day to get the weekly challenges done, it is to instead spread that time out over these 7 days of the week, making sure to get those 6 boosted daily matches in each day, while slowly chipping away at the weekly challenges on the side and using any double XP boosts you have conservatively by only maximizing this initial burst of XP at the start of each day. Of course the XP progression system is subject to change per 343's decisions. If it does change, I will leave updates and changes in a pinned comment for this video. So that's all I've got, if you want to see more great content you can head over to my channel and if you're new consider subscribing. You're helping me feed my cat, her name's Marshmallow. Have a great day, if you're here today, have a great Friday, and a great weekend, and as always, thanks for watching.